conducting a blitz on aggressive driving as well as commercial motor vehicle inspections. Uh, so far, since 8 this morning, we've caught three stunt drivers, all exceeding 50 kilometers per hour. Penalties are a summons to go to court, a license suspension, and a seven-day impoundment of the vehicle they were operating. It's not only about the police and the enforcement pieces, but members of the community understanding that in order for us to keep our roadways safe, they need to, um, they need to join in, in our, uh, obviously in our initiatives, and they need to take driving seriously, and they need to be very safe getting to and from work and traveling throughout our region. So shared responsibility is the most important thing. Uh, leaving uh, more than enough time so they don't have to rush to work or any of their appointments. We often hear um, that they're late, uh, members of our community are late and they need to get somewhere for a certain time. Leave a lot of time um, to do that so they don't feel as if they're rushing. The biggest issues we have is preventative maintenance. Uh, operators aren't doing their daily inspections. They're not looking for your cracked U-joints. They're not looking for suspension problems. Uh, a lot of the big problems we get is overweight. Right, so everyone's not following the gross manufacturer weight restrictions. You know, somebody is going to Home Depot, picking up a trailer, overloading it, and driving down the street, and it's not safe. So they should be following the rules and what that manufacturer says the weight for that vehicle is, and then towing accordingly. This is a, these are the, some of the biggest problems we have. Brakes out of adjustment. That's in your pre-trip, you should be doing it every morning. It takes 10 minutes in the morning, go around your truck, take a look at everything that needs to be fixed you know, you get it done. That's it. It keeps the road safe. It keeps us safe. It keeps the motorist safe. Everyone gets to go home in one piece.